Hi, this is my friend Shannon, Shannon and she's going to do an unboxing of the new Keurig Compact coffee maker that she purchased today at Walmart. Yeah. And you remember Shannon from the Cooking with Coach Rob. So what we've got in the box here is we've got a Welcome to Keurig Let's Get a K-Cup Brewing Manual, right? Yep. Yeah. And we've got the plug that goes in the power cord with a red safety red thing red on it. Safety thing. Safety thing, oh, and we got nice. this. Looks well packed here, yeah. and we might have to pause it here for Shannon to lift it out. Is she going to be able to lift it out? I don't know. I'll try. Well, she's got it. She's being extra careful, right? Yeah. Oh, maybe here. What I'll do is I'll move this out of the way, then you can put okay. it back down on the okay. on the thing here. We're filming this with the cell phone. We're not using the regular. Um, camera today because we thought we would um, do something a little different here. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, look at, oh, it. Look at it. It's so beautiful. Okay. I think the red looks good. Yeah. Like the one I have at home is, is, is the black. It's a different model. Yeah. But this is more slick. I actually kind of like this one a way better than mine because okay. it's... um. It takes up less room on the on the counter. Yeah. Take the tape off. Yeah, so this is the compact Keurig 1.06 liters. It's nice, I like the red. Yeah, and we got some tape on this side too. Yeah. Sure you can have to take the tape off. Huh? I'm still trying to film here though. Oh. We're doing good. Oh, that was thin for the water. Oh. oh. Okay, right now we got it out, out of the box. Yeah. And Shannon's going to place it all on her counter over there and she might try to make a cup of coffee too. I'm not sure yet what she's going to do. How do I do and do the safety plug? The safety plug. We gotta unplug the safety plug and we'll put it in on the counter there. The unboxing the Keurig. Okay, so I'm gonna help Shannon it out a little bit here. This is the the base. We're gonna rinse it out a bit more. And there's a max fill line here. So be careful, you don't want to go over the max the max fill line. It's, it won't, um, it will still work and all that, but it may not heat it up as... Now, I've already rinsed it up, we're just doing another quick rinse. And so we're going to go up here and... Now, that does get heavy when, when, when you go to fill it. So when I have mine at home, it's a slightly different model. I have a jug that I use to pour it in. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to... Oh, that goes on there nice and easy and we are we are right at the fill line so we don't want to go over the fill line we're actually right on it like so and that's gonna we're just gonna slide it in a, a, a bit here then we're gonna do a quick pause and we'll do the next step okay now Shannon's gonna turn it on to heat it up and you see the light here it's 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 it says it's it's warming where, where is it? Oh, you can't. It's green, right? Green. There, then when it's ready to go, there will be some sort of indication. I'm not sure if these will light up. They might light up. I know on mine they do, but we'll find out in a sec. So Shannon's going to go over here now. She's going to pick up what one she's going to have tonight for her um, initial one. So that's just the sound of it heating up. So Shannon's going to go into her bag now. She's going to pick out which one she wants. Like. What other ones did you buy today? Is that, do you want to show the viewers what else is in the bag? Like what else you bought for the Keurig? A lot of coffee. Oh. How do my batteries get in there? Rob. <laughs> <laughs> and I bought my... Donuts. Okay. But anyway, Shannon's going to put one of these on. So we're going to pan back over here. Oh. And it's still warming up. 
it's still warming up so we'll be back when it's warmed up so it is heated up it's heated up when it stops making its sounds so I'm, I'm just going to pan into here and show you that well Shannon's going to show how you how you put the cure again first you just put it in like you move your left hand don't shut it yet okay now now you can see it's in here then she's just going to push that down then over here we'll just show you on the other side here oh it's blinking yeah so she can choose the, the one that she wants and she's going to go for the medium sized one it doesn't take that long to do and you can see the ones he chose is the middle one it's got the blue light Should be coming out soon. Yeah. Maybe it's still heating up a bit, or oh, here it comes. See the Keurig making the the coffee now. It, it, when it's done, it won't that cup won't look that full because that's a bigger cup. That's a pretty big cup on there, right? But it does have the three sizes, and Shannon did pick the medium one on the side, so that's actually a pretty good drink size. It's a bit actually more than I thought. Yeah. So we'd like to thank you for watching this um, unboxing of the all new Keurig um, coffee maker. If you have any questions, please like like um, us a note in a, sorry like us a note. Send us a note in the description, and please like and subscribe. This is Rob and Shannon signing off for December thirtieth, two thousand nineteen. An unboxing of Shannon's new Keurig.